the stress that I get from business is extremely low because I'm not scared to go to zero. My question is, how do you handle stress and adversity in your businesses? By realizing it doesn't mean dick. <laughs> I mean it, I have never been able to really get down on business because I basically make pretend in my mind when something awful happens in business that instead of this awful thing that happened, we had a great day, but I got a phone call that one of the 10 people I love the most died in a horrific accident, and it just wakes me up and puts me in perspective. I have business in a very big perspective. I am unbelievably not interested in money. I do not validate myself. I'm not interested in flashy shit. I'm into the game. Money is great, it's fine. It, it rewards a lot of opportunity, but the stress is easy when you don't have your emotions wrapped up in the success of your business. Yeah. Like, I love doing business. Like, the reason I garage sale or go do a week at a baseball card show like I just did is because I love the process, not the gifts that are given to me personally from the business. So, the stress that I get from business is extremely low because I'm not scared to go to zero. Yeah, makes sense. You understand? Yeah. And that, if you go deeper, is grounded in the fact that I don't give a fuck what anybody thinks about me. Yeah. If I completely collapse and go to zero and everybody here and all of social and all of internet says, see, he was full of shit, he wasn't good, I generally wouldn't care. <laughs> yeah. I just have no interest in living my life based on other people's opinions. Thank you. I just think you need to put business in perspective. Like, and also I'm thankful for playing. Like the cost of entry of being an entrepreneur is having ridiculously difficult days. You wanna live your life on your own terms? Of course it should be hard. Otherwise we'd all be doing it. Perspective. Thanks. You got it.